Welcome to you, my name's Dale and this is Dale's Addiction. Today I'm excited to share with you a couple of things that I picked up. Mm, perhaps a little early but nonetheless um, I've been waiting for one of them for quite a while and I was really lucky with the other one. If you're new to my channel, welcome, thank you very much for joining me and for those of you who've come back again, you might be surprised or you might not. I may have mentioned this item previously. I am celebrating um, a bit of rosé champagne here because I'm happy. <clears throat> you know the worst thing that's happened to me recently, the worst, my husband now has, now has a taste for rosé champagne, which means that I have to share. The good part of that is though that now we can buy a bottle and I don't look bad for being the only one drinking it. <laughs> okay, so I am going to go with Louis Vuitton first. Now, I adore Louis Vuitton and I really adore my wonderful contact there who it's just a pleasure to talk to. And she sent me a message and said, hey, listen, I've got something you might be interested in. I know you were interested in it last year. Would you like it? She sent me a photo. I said, absolutely, I would like it. And I went in this morning, had a glass of champagne. We had a chat. It was wonderful. And uh, I'll show you. It comes in this box. Now, I've not talked about this item, so good luck picking out what it is. It's a very snug fit. Any ideas? Looks like a small leather good. Yes. I was lucky enough. Last year I wanted one of these and I missed out. I was lucky enough to secure. I love the smell of it. The Christmas animation passport holder. Check out this beautiful rose pelerine lining. Now, the irony of 2020 Christmas collection passport holder is not lost on me, and that is what I love about it. Perhaps it's a good luck charm. Maybe it will bring us all good luck. I hope so. But the first time I use this is going to be a wonderful, wonderful time in any respects. So I... I'm super stoked that this one was the Ferris wheel. I really love all the pink in the Ferris wheel. It's just beautiful level of detail. I, I hope that's coming across. It's just stunning. And it, it has a smell that reminds me of back to school. I can't quite put my um, finger on what it is, but look at this. It's so beautiful. So now I've got a piece of Christmas animation for the last three years. And that makes me really happy. I've got the mini pochette from three years ago. I have the, oh, two years ago it must be. Then I have the round coin purse from last year. So Vivian was in Venice. And this year, the festival. So I'm um, yeah, really excited about this piece and I can't wait to use it. Now, sometimes we are lucky and yes, we're all aware of the little bonuses, but <clears throat> something I want to share with you. I got some beautiful perfume samples. I got the Corbaton, I got the Le Jour Celevi, Cele, I don't know. Um, I love Corbaton, I love it. I'm going to try the other one, but can I tell you ladies and gents, if you want your man to smell insanely good, you need to get some of this La Immensity. It is, it is so good that my stepson smelt it on my husband and asked him what it was and he needed to get some. That's how good it is. It's awesome. So highly recommend. I'll put it in the description box below. Just an interesting side note before I get to my Fendi unboxing. I hear a lot of people talk about their relationships with um, sales associates and, you know, and their hit and miss. And 
I read an article the other day that was written by a bunch of people, also Amy Cuddy, and those of you who aren't familiar with Amy Cuddy, she is basically famous for her TED talk on power poses and how you can change your hormone levels between testosterone and cortisol to position yourself to be much more confident. Anyway, this article was called Connect Then Lead and in the art by um, the Harvard Business Review. And in the article, they talked about how both strength and warmth are fundamental qualities of leaders and that you need to be warm and strong to be an effective leader and that leaders that are only strong with a little bit of warmth are very rare in terms of being seen as effective by their subordinates. Anyway, the reason I tell you this is because I think it doesn't matter about leadership, it's all relationships. And one of the things that I find important about connecting with people, particularly people who, if you are about to invest a lot of money and you have your heart set on something and it's a dream piece or whatever the case is, that you connect as human beings, not as you are here to serve me. Um, I really believe that everybody operates on that level. They want to know that you're confident about who you are, so that strength piece, that you're genuine and authentic, and that you're warm and you care about them as well. And so my top tip for anybody wanting to connect and build relationships so that they can eventually get things that they like or to be thought of is to think of those things. How are you showing up? What's your 50%? Anyway, there's a little lecture from me in terms of building relationships. It works in all areas of your life, but especially when you're going to invest big dollars. So I feel like I should move this um, somewhere where I can't spill it. I have spilled a glass of red wine in this room before and it looked like the Sopranos had been here. It was not good. Thankfully, there was no permanent damage. <laughs> All right, this, this is what I've been waiting for for quite a while. Those of you who might have seen a Come Shopping With Me video a long while back may have an idea. If you think you know what it is, put it in the comments box below. It's only a little baby. Comes in a little dust bag like this. I am super excited to have in my possession The Lilac Mini Baguette. This colour is off the charts. Beautiful. Ada, it's your fault that I went for the mini, but not that I bought another baguette. Um, Ada recently purchased this one in the blush pink and it just sold me. I thought, why do I need another regular baguette? But I wanted this colour before I found Carrie. So the day that I went shopping and bought Carrie home, I was actually looking for this one. Oh, the colour. Uh, no regrets about Carrie though. Carrie is a bonus. But this beautiful colour, I, I just can't, I hope it's coming across true to colour. I've actually still got the sticker on here. How good is that? This bag was sourced for me by my wonderful, wonderful, wonderful friend at Fendi named Bessie from Thailand. So after I bought this little baby up here, um, I said, hey, listen, I cannot get this color off my, out of my mind. Is there any way we could chase one down? Is there any way? And uh, she was able to locate uh, more regular size than mini size. And I said, but I, I really think that I want the mini size. And I talked to Ada about what fit and I watched her video about what fit. And I thought, I don't need another regular. Um, I know it's hard, but I want the mini. And a couple of stores declined to transfer the bag because they said it was on hold or 
they were reserving it for VIPs. But one store was happy to let it go and this little girl came all the way from Thailand. So somebody's had a holiday this year. Um, inside there's a longer strap. And it is gold hardware and that's not my usual thing. And it is a lot of gold hardware. However, it's a baguette. So I can, uh, I can live with it. <laughs> I can... I could more than live with it. It's beautiful. All right, before I put the strap on, this is lamb. So it's beautiful and soft. It's so smushy, like that's flat. It's so, God, you need to feel one. You need to feel one. Um, inside, you've just got some card slots. So there's what, one, two, three card slots. And there's a little um, tab there, three card slots. There is the Fendi made in Italy tab and then the date code underneath but that's it it's a big space and it does hold a plus size iphone i'll do a first impressions at some stage so you can hand hold this little baby <laughs> look how tiny these little claws are she's absolutely divine absolutely and i'm so excited that i now have three baguettes they are super, super, super addictive, um, at least for me anyway. And the color range just makes the possibilities endless. And they don't play silly games. Yes, they have limited edition colors. They don't play silly games um, that you might not ever see a purple bag ever again. Um, like someone else we know. Uh, so you can get what you want. And that's what I really love. I think Fendi have insane workmanship just insane quality i mean there's just the every detail on this bag is just beautiful um not to mention like the should we do some asm <laughs> there's no words the color range the quality the fashionability, the collectability, the versatility. How many other illities can I find to describe why I love this brand so much? Honestly, if you are looking for something a bit different and you're not worried about resale and you're worried more about having fun with fashion and having something that lights up your day, check Fendi out. It's just, it doesn't compare to any other house in my opinion. Now, I did have a second Fendi bag and uh, Rita and Bessie were very kind and gave me a bottle of champagne to celebrate my new purchase. And, and a beautiful card. This is something that you could frame. Um, and it's really, really lovely. Um, <laughs> more baguettes um, it's really really lovely just to have a token of um, friendship and appreciation and a little piece of art as well I'm assuming that this is from the Rome this is the Rome flagship I, I'm going to say it is so there you have it my 2020 Christmas animation passport holder and my new Fendi mini baguette. I'm a lucky girl. I put out videos on Wednesdays and Sundays. So I will see you next time. Bye.